guys and welcome to a new video. In today's video, I wanted to talk to you about film school and whether it's worth investing or going into film school. So I went to film school for about three and a half years and I can personally say and attest that I think film school is absolutely not worth it and I would not waste your time with it. And I'm gonna explain why in today's video. After going to film school for three and a half years, I was under the impression that, you know, you would build connections, that, you know, after film school, you'd be able to get an industry. Having a degree in film would help you, you know, get jobs. This was all absolute BS. It's definitely not how it works in the real world. And I'm gonna go through that right now. After I went to film school, and I'm not gonna particularly name the film schools, it's not to, you know, bash them or anything like that. It's just in general really as well but this is what pretty much happened they give you this incentive that you know yeah you're gonna make movies you're gonna make short films you're gonna learn how to make films and all this other stuff and you know you kind of do the different roles like you know director continuity you do a bit of sound you you be the first ad you know camera assist the camera operator and stuff but the truth is for the amount you're going to be paying and for the amount of time you have to invest you can pretty much learn all of that on a good week's shoot on set. So honestly, what I would suggest if you guys are starting out and wanting to get into film or photography or whatever it is, get yourself out there and start like, you know, making connections that way. Start off as a PA, which is pretty much a production assistant or as a runner. And that way you'll kind of get your foot in the door. You do a good job, you know, just kind of, you know, getting people coffee, just showing that you're reliable, coming on time, helping out with whatever they need help with. This is the best way to get yourself in the industry. And you will have to slug around a bit like this in the beginning. This is just the reality and how it generally works in the film world. But once you've done a bit of your fair share, people will start calling you back and bringing you back on as, you know, as a camera assist, as a, you know, as a line producer, whatever you want to do particularly, you'll get those kind of roles. And another great way to kind of get into the industry is to start getting on more student films as whatever you want to be. For example, if you want to be a camera operator, get on student films or short films that are looking for camera operators. Obviously make sure, you know, you're somewhat, you know, knowledgeable in that area or whether you're continuity, producer, whatever the role is, if you start shifting into those, you know, the short film roles, you'll start getting your name out there on IMBD, etc., and then you can start getting on the bigger roles that will pay more money. What I learned going to film school is you will get a large, large debt and you don't really come out with a lot of knowledge. The most knowledge I got out of film school was really basic, basic knowledge. I didn't even learn really the fundamentals of how to operate a camera. Luckily for me, I actually learned all of that before going to film school. I just went to film school because, you know, my family wanted me to get a degree in something, so I said, okay, I'll do it. But for me, realistically, I already knew how a camera operated. I was really hoping to learn more in terms of how, you know, films work, collaboration, you know, the roles are, you know, kind of more defined because I thought, you know, going for an advanced diploma would, you know, get me that. Unfortunately, it didn't and I spent a lot of time doing it and a lot of money down the drain. It's not to say that all the money was wasted, but I would, if I could go back in time, I would definitely say get on film sets because me just getting on a few film sets, I learned more in, in that time than I ever did going to film school for three and a half years. And that's honestly the truth, guys. So don't waste your hard-earned money. Don't get loans from the government, which you'll be paying back for years. Don't make that mistake. Consider getting on film sets. Get yourself out there. That's the best way to build connections. I will say this, when I went to film school, a lot of people in my tier dropped out, about more than half the class dropped out, and the other half, they went their own way, they went into hospitality, retail, I've tried to connect with a lot of them, no one really responds, no one's interested anymore. So it's like, you go in there in, with the hopes of building collaboration with these creatives, and then they never reach out again. And it's like, I've got the equipment, I've got the camera, I've got the passion, I've got the eagerness to learn and wanna do scripts and all this stuff, and for the most part, no one gets back to you. I've got maybe one, uh, close friend, maybe two, uh, two, one from another tier higher up, and then one that's uh, that was also higher up as well. But I, but I stay in touch with, and that's pretty much it, guys. Like so, that's the reality. So the best way is get yourself out there, build those connections, and slowly but surely you'll get more roles, and that's the best way to get in this industry because it is hard, it is oversaturated, and the only way you're going to make it is if you go down this way. So. Yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions but like i said after going three and a half years in film school two different film schools i can definitely say i don't recommend it don't waste your money guys 
get on film sets, even start creating your own stuff, look on YouTube, find other sources because I'm telling you, it'll be worthwhile for you in the end and you won't spend a whole bunch of money that you're gonna be paying back for years to come. Be smart, check out other channels, uh, you know, get yourself on film sets, build connections that way. I promise you, you'll appreciate it and you'll thank me later. All right, guys, that's it for this video. And as always, I'll see you guys on the next one. Stay safe. Be well.